Hey booktube, welcome back. I'm Winx and the ink I'm talking about today is my December TBR. So currently I'm working on two books, the first of which is an audiobook and that is Daring Greatly by Brene Brown. I am a total fangirl for Brene Brown. I love her books. Uh, they are self-help books. This one in particular is about going out and doing big things that are scary and make you vulnerable but that you really want to do and that are totally worth doing and yes I'm very excited this just seems like a very appropriate moment in my life to read such a thing so I am only about two hours into it at the moment but I'm looking forward to getting some more time on it soon hopefully this last week hasn't really had as much audiobook time or focus from me so um, hopefully that will be changing soon and I will have more time to get through her lovely words of wisdom. The second book that I'm working on at the moment is a novella, which is Penrick's Mission by Lois McMaster Bejold. I absolutely love these books. This is the third in the Penrick novella series, which is following the character Penrick and his demon. And this novella series itself is set within the World of the Five Gods series that um, Bejold writes and which I love. And yes, I was so excited to find out that this one had come out. And um, I'm about 20% through it right now. I was doing a bit of reading on it this morning and I'm thinking that I will probably finish it up tonight or at least get close to it. I am actually about to get ready for bed right now. I'm wearing my jammies. But it's only about 140 pages total, I believe, so it should not take too long to finish. For the rest of the month, I have five books picked out, though I don't know if I will get to all of them. It's always hard for me to predict how much time I will have to read in December because I always take off at the end of the month for the holidays, and I always think that because I'm taking vacation time, I will have lots of reading time. But then, of course, I never quite have as much as I think because I'm off visiting my family and doing things with them and not reading, so um, we will see. But um, in any case, I've picked out several and hopefully I will get to at least a few of them. The first on my list is The Ninth Life by Clea Simon. I have been meaning to read this book for months now and I'm so excited to finally be getting to it. I did read the first chapter for the try a chapter tag that I did a while back and I was very intrigued by it. So yes, I'm very much looking forward to getting back into this one. Next I have The Philosopher Kings by Joe Walton, which is the second book in her series and I am not sure of the name. I think the series is called Thessaly, but I could be wrong. Um, I mean, we can all just look it up. But uh, anyway, the first book in the series is The Just City and I read that last month and I really enjoyed it. So I went to the library and saw they had this one. So I decided to go ahead and pick it up. Then I also picked out The White Queen by Philippa Gregory. This is a historical fiction and I generally enjoy reading historical fiction and historical fantasy during the wintry times of the year so um, this seemed like a good pick for December. And I have had this one on my shelf for quite a while so I'm definitely looking forward to hopefully picking it up. Then as most of you know, next month is the Sherlock Holmes reading month. So I will be reading only Sherlock Holmes related things and I'm very excited about that. But January is also vintage sci-fi month and I really enjoyed doing that last year. So I decided that since I'm doing the Sherlock stuff next month, I will do my vintage sci-fi month in December. So I picked out The Illustrated Man by Ray Bradbury and this is sort of extra fitting because last year for vintage sci-fi month, I read The Martian Chronicles also by Ray Bradbury. And I recently got this copy at the Amazon bookstore here in Portland, Oregon, and I just really, really loved the cover. I thought it was super cool looking. And um, yeah, I've just been, like I said, meaning to read more Bradbury books because I really enjoyed The Martian Chronicles. So I'm excited to try this one out and have my own little vintage sci-fi month. Then finally, if it works out and we have time, I was going to do a buddy read with Luisina on The Daughter of the Forest by Juliet Morillier. And this one I also read the first chapter of for the try a chapter tag, um, but that chapter was actually like 50 pages long. So that gave me a pretty good sense of the book and I am loving what I've seen so far. So hopefully that works out. I am very excited to get back to that one and I think it will be a very fun one to buddy read. All right, so that is my December TBR. I would love to hear down below what you guys are reading and if you've read any of these books and what you thought about them. If you are doing Vintage Sci-Fi Month or the Sherlock Holmes Reading Month and maybe you want to do Vintage Sci-Fi Month with me this month, 
that would be cool. Um, yeah, let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you'd like to see more. I hope you're all having a good start to the week and I will talk to you soon. Bye!